Hello guys, good afternoon. This is Miss Henderson. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you again for tuning in. Thank you to my existing subscriber that has been subscribing to this channel. Thank you so much for your support and your gratitude. It really meant a lot to me when you subscribe to my channel or you drop a comments below and you know just let me know something constructive something positive that you know what you would like me to provide you with next um, I strive to help CNA and nursing students to pass their state board exam and you know to be gainfully employed and do something positive in society to make a difference in the lives of others so please consider if you're new here please consider subscribing to my youtube channel please like and share and please smash that um, subscribe button so today i have a few questions here that can help to enhance your um cna grade or your prometric exam so i am going to be reading these questions and while i'm reading it take a moment i'll give you the answer yes but um take the time to really think about the question and try to come up with your own answer so question one catheters are used for used for patients who are incontinent to promote patient comfort to keep the bed dry to collect a routine urine specimen think about it take a moment and think about it so catheter is a tube that um, is inserted into the patient's secondary to um, urinary incontinence. And part of our job as a CNA is to help to keep that tube flowing properly and to clean it. So that moment is up and the answer is to promote patient comfort. That's the correct answer and I'm going to bold it. Question number two. A resident has a catheter, the NA, NA stands for nursing assistance, should attach the drainage bag to an IV pole, the bed frame, the bed rails, the bedside stand. Take a moment and think about the answer. So the correct answer is the bed frame. That's where you should attach the drainage bag to. Question number three. A patient has incontinence and is using incontinence product. To safely use the products, the nursing assistant should ask a coworker how to use the product, follow the plan of care, follow the manufacturer's instructions, ask the person how to use the product take a moment and think about it so the correct answer for this question is to follow the manufacturer's um, instructions that's the correct answer question number four you are applying a condom catheter the nursing assistant should roll the catheter onto the penis Apply to the tip of the penis with elastic tape. Insert into the urethra, secure with an adhesive tape. Take a moment and think about the answer. So that moment is up and the answer is roll the catheter onto the penis. Oftentimes, um, you may be asked by your charge nurse to apply a condom catheter to collect a urine specimen from a patient so you just roll it onto the penis that's the correct answer question number four question number five constipation is gas in the stomach passage of hard dry stool prolonged retention of feces inability to control the passage of stool take a moment and think about it so the correct answer for this question is passage of hard dry stool that's the correct answer question five question number six which is not a cause of fecal incontinence diarrhea intestinal disease not getting enough 
not getting into the bathroom, a high fiber diet? Take a moment and think about it. So the correct answer for this question is A. A high fiber diet does not contribute to incontinence. Question number seven. Which is the preferred position to administer an enema? Take a moment and think about the answer. So the correct answer for this question is the Sims or left lying position. That's the correct answer. Question number seven. Question eight, for food served in a long-term care facility, Obra requires hot food, food prepared with fat, without fat, food that is appetizing, or for three meals with no snack. Think about the answer. So the correct answer for this question eight is food that is appetizing. Nine, diabetes meal planning involves consistency in what is eaten and when, eating only carbohydrates, high iron diets, avoiding fats. Take a moment and think about the answer. So the correct answer for this question is consistency in what is eaten and when. A person is on aspiration precaution. When the person is finished eating, you need to check them out for the need for oral hygiene, pocketing, mouth sores, gum disease. Take a moment and think about the answer. So the correct answer is pocketing. Question 11. To give hair care, you begin by parting the hair into two section, four section, five section, six section. Take a moment and think about it. The correct answer is two section. Question 12, when cleaning the urinary catheters, the nursing assistant should clean four inches downward from the insertion site towards the insertion site with circular motions, with up and down motions. Take a moment and think about the answer. So the correct answer is A, clean four inches downwards. Question 13, painful or difficult urination is desoria, nocturia, oligra, polyuria. The correct answer for this question is A, desoria, painful upon urination. Question 14, when shampooing a person in bed, you need a shampoo tray and a basin, a handheld nozzle, a stretcher, a hair dryer. Take a moment and think about the answer. So the proper equipment you need when shampooing a patient's hair is a shampoo tray and a basin. So guys, that's it for this video. Um, I hope these questions can um, Enhance your grade and 
help you pass the CNA Prometric exam. So again, these questions are meant to deepen your understanding and help you, help you succeed in your CNA journey or the CNA world. Please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. Please like and share and drop your comments below. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the other one. Bye for now.